least nine persons were reportedly killed when suspected armed robbers invaded the Isan Lu branch of First Bank in Kogi State on Thursday. The victims were identified as eight policemen and one civilian. Among those killed was a divisional police officer in the town, five other policemen and two policewomen. While the DPO, two policewomen and four policemen were killed at the police station, one policeman was killed at the bank premises. The other victims died after he was hit by a stray bullet. The armed robbers were said to have invaded the police station about 1 p.m. and opened fire on all officers, men on duty. They also set free all the detainees in the detention facility. The robbers later proceeded to the bank where they killed one policeman and cattered away money. The police public relations officer of Kogi State Command, William Ayer, confirmed this. He, however, said the command was yet to ascertain the number of casualties. And that is it. This is, this is really shocking. As in, really, really shocking. How can armed robbers invade a whole police station? and kill people as if as if they are cutting onions just like that all the reports or what i read now i did not hear anything that they 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 cut one of them or something that is to show you how porous our security system is in this country if armed robbers can enter a police station and do all these things and go scot free without one at least one being caught or being shot that means what, what, what do you think that means our security is not strong we are not secured since they survived this the attack they they, they, they did in a police station the police that's supposed to be the, the the one of the security arms in the country so what do you think will happen to a, a, a lay person or person or, or, or somebody that does not have facilities of all this kind of uh, security. I don't think this is a funny thing at all. It's not funny at all. How can you say you are a security uh, 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 officer and they invaded your own territory, killed people just like that? It's a pity. It's a pity. I pity the people that were killed. And which way are we going? Armed robbers will just come from nowhere only to attack police men and women in, the, in their police station just like that. I don't understand how these things are happening. But it's very painful and at the same time very shameful for us. That our security arm cannot even protect themselves, not to talk of protecting others. Well, let's hear what people are saying about this. Somebody says, uh, people's father, husband, brothers, and sons, so sad. May their soul rest in peace. Amen. Like seriously, security under this administration is not valid. During situations like this, police should deploy drones to surveil operation and movement to track criminals. Our system really needs upgrading. Old system of 1916 policing should be dropped and abolished, really. Why are the officers not wearing their uniform? And why did the robbers feel the need to go to the police station after the bank? Something does not add up. Of course. The, another person said, the earliest report said that the robbers, were, the robbers went to the station first before robbing the bank. Of course, that could be right so that there, won't, there wouldn't be any support for the bank security. If they robbed before going to the station, there would have been police response and attack on the robbers. 
this is so sad this is so sad i will be better from them nigerian police force to protest for better welfare and well equipped in order to avoid this type of calamity without that nigerian government cannot oh, wow even our police can't be trusted if government provided it for them some will use it to kill innocent citizens some will hire it to arm robbers kidnappers and hire the assassin they use it to rob themselves our police cannot be trusted with better ammunition this is very very serious it's boiling up it's really boiling up well, how can you say that a, a arm robbers came to to the police station and killed policemen on duty not one caught another person say may their souls rest in peace if they were not part of the policemen that helped to rig erection in kogi <laughs> if they ate talks in any way in kogi or looked the other way when electorates were being oppressed they can not they can rot in hell wow it's not easy this is people's life we are talking about people's life we are talking about people's father people's parents just died just like that it's such a bizarre ordeal it's quite unfortunate it's quite unfortunate it's a sad one it's a nasty experience that nobody will pray for you are saying police when i see how they pain when on our boys they waste people for street may the dead rest in peace the living should wake up and sanitize their rank first then go after bad actors unless these eight are just going to be statistics like the civilian that died of bad cops this is so sad so sad police are worse than these criminals they should put their house in order because most of these weapons used by the criminals are given to them by our security men rest in peace guys another person say similar to the offer robbery incident i have this feeling they will be caught but at the end of the day the investigation will be compromised case in point at the end of the day the the investigation will be compromised case in point was when the leader of the offer gang died in police custody under mysterious circumstance we hope this doesn't go same way it, it has happened uh, it has happened let's wait and see if these armed robbers will go away with this or if the nigerian police force will take full responsibility and uh, fish them out let's see if they will be brought to book or if they will just spill the blood of innocent police officers and go scot-free well i would like to hear your own opinion what do you think about this nasty incident what is your own contribution what do you have to say a lot of people have been saying a lot of things about this incident a lot of people are commenting i would like to hear yours too because i know nobody is happy about this it's a sad one a very very sad news people's life are involved people's money are involved especially that of uh, our nigerian policemen and, and women so i'm waiting to hear your comments in the comment section and uh, i will see you in the next video bye bye